Good evening, everyone. I'm Ignatius, and this is Namesh, and it's an honor, pleasure, and privilege to be Jerome's best man. They say that friendship starts with a wrong impression of the other person, and this was certainly the case with big Jerome over here. We met in year seven at Mazenau College in Mulgrave, and Jerome, even in year seven, seemed like the type of bloke who had a lot of friends. So I thought to myself, you beauty, I'll stick around with this bloke and I probably won't get beat up. JD in high school was a very, very likeable person. He was always smiling, I'm unsure why, he was at an all boys school. Um, but, he had a, but he had a good vibe about him, like, that he still keeps to this day. He went through your typical phases, young Sri Lankan Australian kid would go through. There was the sporting phase, there was the pretending to be um, an academic phase and of course the wannabe gangster face. Vish and I has 14 years age difference. So the moment Vish was born, I took the role of being the big sister and took care of her. There are a few funny stories that happened when we took care of babysitting for mum. Once I was carrying Vish and I dropped her. She fell head first and landed on the floor. So that's why she's not so perfect, so Jerome. I did ask some hard questions from uh, Jerome when we first met. Um, do you like sports? Otherwise you know, it doesn't, doesn't fit in. Whiskey. Um, and I also told him that you hurt my sister, I'm going to kill you. And then, and then Vishu told me he's got a gun when he works, so just be careful. So I said, like, all right, I'll, I'll stay her back a bit. I just want to say that I'm so proud of you, Vish. I had the privilege of seeing you grow into a beautiful person that you are now. You are a role model to all our nieces and nephews. In her eyes, I might be a annoying little brother, but in my eyes, she was the most caring sister that anyone could have. I guess this is the time that I would normally pass on some words of wisdom about marriage, but I realize the two of you have been doing this for a few months now. And not only being married, but doing so through some very trying times and circumstances, it's, it's really massively inspiring how the two of you have remained calm, strong, grounded and resilient, and done it all as a team through all the hurdles that you faced through the last couple of years. Vish, I want to welcome you to our family. Your warmth and your love shown towards all of us and our family and the boys, Ethan, Vince, Jacob, says so much about you, and we welcome you with open arms. Vish, you truly are a beautiful person, inside and out, and you give my life so much purpose and meaning. You challenge me each and every day to be the best version of myself, and for this, I am eternally grateful and I truly don't have words thank you enough. I love everything about you, Vish. I have witnessed you over the past six years achieve so much. I know the last couple of years have been tough for us, but I know and trust that with you by my side, we can accomplish anything. Vish, without fail, you always put everyone else's happiness before your own, and I admire this greatly about you. I love your passion and your dedication to your studies and work, your smile, your laugh, your sense of humour, your humbleness and maturity. You're not perfect, Vish, but who really is? What really matters to me is that you are perfect to me. Jerome, I want to just check if you still love me. <laughs> Thank you for answering that question a million times over the last six years, even after we were married. Thank you for pushing me to be bold, to take scary steps towards my passions and goals. I've been blessed with a life partner that isn't perfect, but is perfect for me. I can't promise you a perfect life or a future, and I can't promise you that our relationship will be easy. I can only promise you my loyalty, my respect, head scratches, hugs, and that I will always be by your side during your struggles. I can promise that I will stick by your side through floods and storms and whatever else is to come, because I don't know. <laughs> Thank you for being my safe place, 
and thank you for holding me when I need it most. Thank you, Auntie Minori, for bringing into this world such a beautiful young lady and guiding and supporting her to become the amazing lady who stands before me tonight. Vish, you are my dream come true, my MVP, my soulmate and my best friend, and I love you with all my heart. Love you.